So Wakelet is a multifaceted, pretty amazing tool that works to allow you to collect a series of resources, organize, curate them, share them, and collaborate with others. If you notice up at the top, I have both a search bar and I've got a showcase. So I just want to show you what a, um, a collection can look like. Uh, these are all available in public and I'm just interested in seeing what Robin Thompson here is sharing in this collection of, of basically how to use Wakelet in your school. So you'll see that she's got the topic here. She's embedded a tweet, some text, a link out to a PDF, again another tweet. So it's a nice visual collection of different types of resources that she's made public and now people can search for that up in Showcase. If I have a very specific topic that I want to look to see if anybody's already created any collections that might be able to help me with my work. With Again, these are public and I have to search through them to see if there's any information that I might want to use with my students or take away or even go ahead and share the whole um, public collection that somebody else has put out there in that way. Here's a, a collection of resources that I've put together for a group of students who are working on a project around reducing their um, carbon footprint. So what you can see here is it's a nice visual representation of the resources that I'm going to ask them to work with. So the group of four who decided that in order to answer this question, they wanted to explore, explore plastics and the ways to reduce plastic consumption and waste. So you'll see at the very beginning of this collection, I have a video recording here of what I'm going to ask them to go ahead and do instructionally with this collection. I also voice recorded it in case um, people wanted to just hear the voice recording instead of watching the video walkthrough. You'll see that I've got three different videos for them to watch along with a website. Again, clicking on each one of those then takes you up to the resources that starts to play so you can watch or read. And then I've linked out to a project note catcher. It's a Google Docs. They're asked to go ahead and make um, uh, a copy for themselves so that they can start editing and keeping track of what they're doing. And then in this project, each student has made a copy of a KWL, what do they want to know, understand, and do. And they're going to start to use this um, slide deck to be able to record as they're doing their research. And then you'll notice after their research has been gathered, they can then start using this to create from that research some synthesis in a way that they're going to present their project to the class and beyond. And what I love about this too is that I can share that with other contributors. And so I can invite my colleagues and my team. I can, um, by uh, copying this link, I can share with any students who are in my classroom who I want to contribute to a project where I can set up individual and small group wakelets for students to contribute to and I can be part of that contribution and I can manage contributors here too which means that I can give them certain permissions um, where they can edit lots of things or they can just simply add content to that.